dear fourth sem electronics and communication stream students welcome back into my channel again okay a long long time okay i think it is the right time to give you the passing package as examinations are very near now so i have taken here the subject control systems okay this is the problematic subject uh, first of all you should remove this thing from your mind that uh, this subject can be passed only by theoretical portion it is not possible so it is a problematic part and the numericals are very simpler ones which i will discuss over here first of all let me discuss how you can pass the control system subjects if you just go through module 4 there are two topics which you should cover and compulsorily you have to cover these two topics that is routes criteria very simpler one uh, already video is available on that and uh, root locus 10 marks it may be sometimes 14 marks problem that is root locus i have also the handwritten notes of the you can see the interface of the notes of roots uh, root locus where i have written the uh, basic problem to the complex problems okay this is the basic problem of root locus and uh, another problems are here which i have written step wise so that you can easily solve root locus problems okay so these 20 marks are just in your pocket my dear friends you should not leave this module at all at any cost you should not leave this module okay you can easily score 20 marks from this i am giving you assurance surety i'm giving you so this is about module 4 roots criteria uh, criteria is also simpler one if i will get time i will also solve problems on roots criteria next is module fifth where you have to go for the body plot okay again a simpler problem simple numericals are there and uh, determine the solution for homogeneous and non-homogeneous state equations there, there is actually polar plot nyquist plot but board plot is somehow simpler than a uh, nyquist or polar plot so go through the body plot at least you will get 10 marks so these are the body plot notes this is the definition part rest of the thing is uh, there are some numericals which i have solved and you should go through these problems whatever, whatever i have written in these particular notes stepwise okay and this is the final body plot graph which i have plotted here try to understand these graphs over the also my videos are available on my youtube channel you can go through my playlist you will find body plot control engineering is the subject name it was actually in the seventh sub mechanical so i have covered this body plot over here you can refer those videos in order to understand the body plot concept okay i have written all the problems you can go through these important notes which i will share later on right so this is all about uh, module fifth okay go through this much body plot at least you will get 10 marks so 20 from here 10 from here that is 30 next is 20 marks you can easily get from the module second that is block diagram reduction technique okay so in order to go through block diagram reduction technique you have to use sometimes Mason's gain formula also and uh, go through the signal flow graph see here the interface of note is here this is the block diagram reduction i have written the uh, procedure in the detail over here okay so you should not go through this detail you should only refer rules for block diagram reduction rules to reduce block diagram so these are some rules seven rules then you can easily solve the problematic part okay this is your uh, problematic part of uh, block diagram okay so step wise i have written down the solution go through i hope you will go through these notes and uh, try some numericals at least you should try five five numericals from block diagram reduction and signal flow graph so see here the interface of the signal flow graph notes this is your signal flow graph right so you should surely practice five five problems from both the topics that is block diagram reduction and signal flow graph so this is all about model two so the, uh, these are the key modules if you just go through then i think you no need to go for the uh, rest of the modules if you just cover these portions whatever i have mentioned so this becomes your 50 marks from three modules if you cover fully then let's come to the module third where you have to prepare some derivation part and also i will provide the solutions for these derive the expression for the rise time of a second order system define steady state error derive the state uh, static error components for uh, type 2 systems find and draw the step response of the first order system and the numericals which are very easier ones uh, which i will also provide in the 
description over there so what are standard test signals explain each one in brief explain pi pid pd control controllers in brief and derive an expression for second order under damped system which is subjected to unit stuff response so this is all about model third next is model first in which some theoretical concepts are there comparison between open loop and closed loop system definitely it will be six marks question define a control system what are the requirements of good control system and also with relevant expression explain the concept of gear trends and there are uh, numericals if you are convenient with the numerical part go through numericals okay so this is all about control system subject to go through these topics whatever i have mentioned so far in this video i am sure you will pass this subject with the flying color this is not the passing subject only you can score in control systems so as much as possible you should practice the numerical part especially the root root locus and body plot problems okay so i wish you all the best for your examinations make sure you will share this video to all your friends who are struggling in control system subjects thank you